Today we're going to look at how to build your very own four-person cedar sauna from puresaunas.com. To begin, open up the three boxes that your sauna comes in. Once you've done this, locate the base and two back panels. You'll need at least two people to assemble your sauna, so be sure you have a friend to help you out. The first step is to line up the two back panels on top of the sauna base, making sure the one panel slides into the other. Ensure that the two panels are tight together and fasten the clips on the side. Next you'll want to attach the two side panels in the door. For the sake of simplicity, we've already attached the left side in this video. You'll notice that the side panel has metal hooks on it as well as the door panel. While holding the door panel in place, hook the two panels together ensuring all of the hooks slide together correctly. Once you've done this, attach the clips on the other side of the panel. Once all of the side panels are attached, you'll need to get the top of the sauna on. You'll notice that the top panel has some small holes in it. These are there to allow the black cables from the side panels to slide through to the top of the sauna. Once you've pulled the cables through, put the top panel in place ensuring that it is flush with the side panels on the inside. Next you'll need to attach the cables on the top of the sauna. We recommend a step ladder for this part. There are five cables in total to attach. On the right side of the sauna, you'll find one set of cables. You'll also notice a hole in the one corner. Feed the bundle of colored wires through this hole. These wires will supply power to your sauna's radio. The remaining connections are on the other side of the sauna. Connect the two black cables and the white one as well. The final connector is near the back of the sauna next to the power cable. For this next part, you'll need to round up a Phillips head screwdriver as well as all of the necessary accessory boxes that came with your sauna. The first thing we'll look at is attaching the handle. Grab the two bolts and four wooden spools supplied as well as your screwdriver. Place the two bolts through the handle and slide two of the spools over the bolts. Slide the bolts through the holes in the door of your sauna and switch to the other side. Slide the two remaining spools over the bolts, line up the other handle, and screw it in. install is your sauna's air refresher. This comes with two fairly long screws, but we recommend swapping them with two of the smaller screws supplied with your sauna. Find the sticker on the wall of your sauna indicating where to install your air refresher. Simply line up the unit, screw it in, and attach the cable that's hanging from the top. should look like this when finished. Your sauna also comes with an audio deck. Slide the audio deck into its holder like so. Remember those cables you fed through the top of your sauna earlier? 
Find where those are hanging and attach them to your audio deck. Both the black component cable and the multicolored wires connect to the back of the unit. Once they're connected, line up the holder with the pieces of wood on the side panel and screw it together through the four pre-existing holes in the audio deck holder. Lastly, your sauna comes with two cup holders. You can choose to either screw these into the wall of your sauna or simply place them on your seat. You will also find two pieces of wood that sit on top of your sauna. All that's left now is to sit back, relax, and enjoy your new sauna.